Well, Harold Camping says tomorrow the rapture is going to occur. The world's probably going to come to an end. So, I figured today might be my last day to, uh, uh, I don't know, plug my book, A Day in the Mind. Why don't you go to Amazon and pick this up? I mean, hey, if you guys are really leaving the planet, you might as well take something to read. I want to dedicate something I wrote way back in 2002 for my first book, A Day in the Mind. This is called Matthew 624, and Harold, I'm dedicating this to you. In a lot of ways, I hope you're right. Been emailing God, still no response. Impatiently waiting, pacing the proverbial floor back and forth like a cat wanting out. Climbing the walls of sanity, peering over the edge of the paradigm that I've been handed just to get a better view. Looking for God online, in chat rooms and news groups, talking with spiritual people who are enlightened and smart about the ways of this world. Educated people from various regions, idiots and fools from every single state. Some say, who's God? Others respond, why bother? Looking for God in electronic things, in shiny things, expensive things of every nature. Searching for signs of divine footprints in prime time television programming. Listening closely to the laugh tracks to hear if God was sitting in the back row of the studio during one of the pre-taped later aired shows. Listening for God on the radio, in the music of our times, in the apathetic, demonic-sounding screams of a generation smart enough to know they're screwed, but too stupid to do anything about it. Looking for God in humanity, in our thoughts, in our desires, our deeds, in the way we treat one another like enemies rather than brothers and sisters living in a house divided, in a house that we have built, with computers and zeros and ones and every plastic thing under the sun but God. Looking for God in this world, still no response. I'm ICP Chan. Thanks for listening. Come see me tomorrow. We'll all give Harold a call.